hey guys welcome back in this video i will show you how to use lazy vertical grid and lazy horizontal grid so let's get started i have already created a project for that let me explain what i have done so far so first of all uh, i will show you the jetpack compose version i have used to use uh, lazy horizontal grid and lazy vertical grid you have to use this compose version 1.2.0 beta 0.2 and the compatible kotlin version is 1.6.1 so let's move to main activity how we have done this first of all let's say about lazy vertical grid so you can see lazy vertical grid here and it takes columns here you have to mention how many columns you want uh, then you have to mention this way grid cells fixed then three four whatever you want then you can mention content padding which is uh, necessary for uh, this uh, gap actually and uh, at last you have to use the items here you can use um, few overloads let me show you whenever you are trying to type item then you will it will show some options like item item items with list items with array items with count something like that but here i have used this one the items with list so inside the items the regular composable you can use and now let's move to the horizontal one So the syntax is very similar. The name is lazy horizontal grid. Here you have to mention the rows and similar way the content padding and in similar way you have to use the items data and you have to use any jetpack composable here as item. So this way we can use uh, lazy horizontal grid and lazy vertical grid in jetpack compose but remember that you have to upgrade the jetpack compose version to 1.2.0 beta 02 and the compatible kotlin version is 1.6.21 hope this video was helpful for you thanks for watching